Today we're out with the new 551 locator from Tempo. That's this beauty right here. And I just used it to mark my wire path going down that direction. Let me show you. Oh, a little too high with the volume. Here's a pro tip. Turn that shit all the way down. Maybe I should turn it up a little bit so you can see the screen. Right there. And I just went along my path and every 10 feet or so, I stopped my locator until I got it to zero out, which puts me right over the wire on null, which boom, there's where my flag is. And now that I flagged out my wire path, I can start poking around it to look for the valve that I believe is somewhere in front of these palm trees. So we're gonna start poking around in there next. But uh, marking out your wire path will give you a visual representation of where the wire is above the ground. You can try to remember where all of those beeping noises happened as you were walking down the sidewalk or green space or whatever, uh, but good luck to you. I can't remember any of that stuff. So I gotta put flags out. Now I have a visual representation of where my wire is. And now I can go grab my poker that I have over here, AKA the alien probe. And then I can start probing around in this line here. And more specifically, if you can tell, to my right as I walk here because that valve is offset uphill a little bit from where that flag is. So that means the main line is running here and they set all the valves on this side of the main line from what I can see for those two valves that are in front of me right there. So when I go this way, I'm gonna start poking obviously where the flag is at, but I'm also gonna poke to the right because that's where I believe the valve is gonna be located. So now, I'm gonna start the process of poking around because I didn't have anything that popped up on my locator to tell me, oh, there it is. So I gotta do this the old school way. Poke around, we're gonna find it eventually. And I'll check back with you when I do. We moved the locator from this location connected to the common wire to the controller connected to zone number eight, the wire going right to the valve. Right now, I have my locator set to 1.75 uh, kilohertz. We're gonna go ahead and start tracking this low and slow. That's where my uh, volume knob is. You'll notice when I go over a valve, nice and loud, right? So we're gonna scan the area. And I know this valve is supposed to be in this location because I have blueprints of the property. So it tells me it's over here somewhere. So we're gonna go ahead and scan the uh, path of the wire that I've already flagged out with these green flags. And we're gonna pray that they didn't put the valve inside of this cluster of palm trees, which is where the blueprints say it is. That would be fun with a capital F. All right, let's see. Oh, we got something here. Now we can zero in on it. All right, now that the numbers are getting up to 100, we gotta lower this down a bit. They're staying high right here. And I'm almost all the way down to like the lowest level of volume. And then I'm just gonna scan this area. And I'm gonna dig right here. To look for the valve. Let's see what we find. All right, we opened up a little bit of a hole here and we've got the locator set to the lowest volume. I can't make it go any lower than that in the volume. And we're gonna stick it in the hole here, nothing. That tells me I need to be digging towards the palm tree, which sucks, but we're gonna keep going until we find this valve. Well, you're not gonna believe this, but it's definitely under the damn tree. You see that little green mark? You see the tree right above it? Yeah, that's not gonna happen. We're gonna need to get this palm tree removed before we can address this valve, which is a major problem because that valve is stuck open right now. 
and the whole property is not receiving water because of it. That's going to be a pain in the ass. Holy crap. Let's open it up some more. Well, we've excavated it a little bit and we got to the flow control on the valve, which is that little X right there. X marks the spot where to turn the water off so that that stuck open zone is no longer stuck open and now the rest of the property can receive water. The next step is moving this valve out from underneath this palm tree. That's gonna be fun.